Hi guys, I welcome you to the very important session on installation of Selenium. Here we'll see the step by step guide to how to install the Selenium. To install the Selenium, actually, the Selenium, as I said earlier, as we have discussed earlier, Selenium has some jar files and the jar files should be configured in Eclipse that is what the process is but to run this selenium we have some environment setup so first thing we need to set up the java environment that is first thing okay so before installing selenium or before configuring selenium the first thing what you need to do is we need to first set up the java environment java jdk java developer kit clear so now to install this uh, Java JDK, so let's have a look on the process. So I have given you the guide here. I guess you people can look at here the step by step guide, including the steps I have given it. And these are all the things what we need to do. So let's go ahead and let's do it now. Right. So chalo, the first one installation of JDK. So a lot of machines you may have JDK or else you may have Java already installed in your machines. You may or you may not. So how to check whether the Java has been installed or not? It's very simple guys. Just move on to your run. Just write CMD command means I'm asking you to go into command prompt. And here in the command prompt simply type as Java space iPhone version. Here we go. If at all Java is already installed in your machine, it will give you out with a version. See a Java version 1.7.79 is already installed in my machine, and this is the environment already set up. It's a mixed mode. So leave about this. It's a it's a 64 bit actually I have with me. So it is uh, giving out the details. Clear? So Java underscore version. If the Java JDK is already installed, then you will get this output. If not, it will show an error message saying that it is not the external or internal command is that clear this is first you need to check it if you have already installed this on your machine then no need of this step one directly you can jump to step two i'm repeating it if already java jdk is installed then there is no need of step one you can directly go to step two so now here i'm assuming that you have installed you have not installed java so let us start from the scratch Yes, let us start from the scratch, guys. So, first, what we need to do, I need to install the Java, Java JDK. Okay, so here we have a website. We can copy this website directly or else just move on to your uh, Google. Just type it as Java JDK download. Here we go. It is from oracle.com. Here. So we have uh, Java SC downloads, Java platform JDK. It's Yite U73 and some version is going on. And we here we have a JDK download. Yes. So either you can click on this Java here or else you can click on this JDK download this one right. So the same thing I have given it here image this is one JDK download you can click on this and accept the agreement. Just accept the agreement. Then search your operating system here. If you are in Mac, go with Mac OS X64. If you are working with Windows, make sure to use the appropriate version. Okay, appropriate OS built. So if it is Windows 64, just go ahead and take this 64. Clear? So how to find that whether your operating is Windows 64 or 32 bit? So basically it will be 64 bit uh, but still we have a solution for it how to find that so here i have given you that so 64 bit os or windows 32 bit 
you can check whether your OS is 62 go to the control panel we have a system and in that you can go ahead with the system type let me show you that go to here we go in a control panel just search for the system we have something called system type here we go 64 bit operating system can you see this guys the, the my, my, mouse is pointed here 64 bit operating system so i need to download 64 now okay so just click on this download link and save it in your machine jdk okay so save it in your machine so we have done with the download so it takes some time so already have downloaded it so i'm not doing it once again so you people should download that just click on this so save it on some location just click on save so it takes some time let me click on cancel so anyways it takes some time so let it download so once after downloading it just you can run it just you need to run that file okay so once after running that file means after installing it i mean to say yes see ya? so run the installer and when the installer is done means whenever you have installed it properly then simple just move on to c drive here we go go to your program files just move to the java here here we go we'll get two folders make sure that you need to get two folders one is jdk and other one is a jre jdk and jre maybe uh, here I have 1.7.0 you may have 1.8.0 or 1.9 that's the other story but you need to have two folders one is jdk and other one is a jre so if you are getting two folders in the sense you have successfully installed your java but that's not sufficient yes downloading and installing a java is not sufficient the next major task what we have is we need to set the environment clear so we need to set the path so that your machine understands where the java is and where should it execute it clear so java has its own platform so your machine will understand that platform your machine will should know where that platform is actually so we need to navigate it we need to provide the information to the system that whenever you want to execute java related stuff use this java jdk something like that clear okay? in a simpler words so let's do that now hi guys i welcome you to the very important session on installation of selenium here we'll see the step by step guide to how to install the selenium to install the selenium actually the selenium as i said earlier as we have discussed earlier selenium has some jar files and the jar files should be configured in eclipse that is what the process is but to run this selenium we have some environment setup so first thing we need to set up the java environment that is first thing okay so before installing selenium or before configuring selenium the first thing what you need to do is we need to first set up the java environment java jdk java developer kit clear so now to install this uh, java jdk so let's have a look on the process so i have given you the guide here i guess you people can look at here the step by step guide including the steps I have given it and these are all the things what we need to do so let's go ahead and let's do it now right so chill out the first one installation of jdk so lot of machines you may have jdk or else you may have java already installed in your machines you may or you may not so how to check whether the java has been installed or not it's very simple guys just move on to your run just write cmd command means i'm asking you to go into command prompt and here in the command prompt simply type as java space iphone version here we go if at all java is already installed in your machine it will give you a 
with the version. See a Java version 1.7.7.9 is already installed on my machine and this is the environment already set up. It's a mixed mode. So leave about this. It's a it's a 64 bit actually I have with me. So it is uh, giving out the details. Clear? So Java underscore version. If the Java JDK is already installed, then you will get this output. If not, it will show an error message saying that it is not the external or internal command. Is that clear? This is first you need to check it. If you have already installed this on your machine, then no need of this. Step one. Directly you can jump to step two. I'm repeating it. If already Java JDK is installed, then there is no need of step one. You can directly go to step two. So now here I'm assuming that you have installed, you have not installed Java. So let us start from the scratch. Yes, let us start from the scratch, guys. So first, what we need to do, I need to install the Java, Java JDK. Okay. So here we have a website. We can copy this website directly or else just move on to your uh, Google. Just type it as Java JDK download. Here we go. It is from Oracle.com. Here. So we have uh, Java SC downloads. Java platform JDK, it's eight U73 and some version is going on. And we here we have a JDK download. Yes. So either you can click on this Java here or else you can click on this JDK download. This one. Right? So the same thing I have given it here. Image. This is one JDK download. You can click on this and accept the agreement. Just accept the agreement. Then search your operating system here. If you are in Mac, go with Mac OS X64. If you are working with Windows, make sure to use the appropriate version. Okay, appropriate OS built. So if it is Windows 64, just go ahead and take this 64. Clear? So how to find that whether your operating is Windows 64 or 32 bit? So basically it will be 64 bit, uh, but still we have a solution for it. How to find that? So here I have given you that. So 64 bit OS or Windows 32 bit. You can check whether your OS is 62. Uh, go to the control panel. We have a system and in that you can go ahead with the system type. Let me show you that. Go to here we go in a control panel. The search for the system. We have something called system type. Here we go. 64 bit operating system. Can you see this guys? The, the my, my mouse is pointed here. 64 bit operating system. So I need to download 64 now. Okay. So just click on this download link and save it in your machine. JDK. Okay. So save it in your machine. So we have done with the download. So it takes some time. So already have downloaded it. So I'm not doing it once again. So you people should download that. Just click on this. So save it on some location. Just click on save. So it takes some time. Let me click on cancel. So anyways, it takes some time. So let it download. So once after downloading it, just you can run it. Just you need to run that file. Okay. So once after running that file, means after installing it, I mean to say. Yes. See here. So run the installer. And when the installer is done, means whenever you have installed it properly, then simple. Just move on to C drive. Here we go. Go to your program files. 
just move to the java here here we go we'll get two folders make sure that you need to get two folders one is jdk and other one is a jre jdk and jre maybe uh, here have 1.7.0 you may have 1.8.0 or 1.9 that's the other story but you need to have two folders one is jdk and other one is a jre so if you are getting two folders in the sense you have successfully installed your java but that's not sufficient yes downloading and installing a java is not sufficient the next major task what we have is we need to set the environment clear so we need to set the path so that your machine understands where the java is and where should it execute it clear so java has its own platform so your machine will understand that platform your machine will should know where that platform is actually so we need to navigate it we need to provide the information to the system that whenever you want to execute java related stuff use this java jdk something like that clear in a simpler words so let's do that now hi guys if you like this video please subscribe to us for more free videos for live instructor lead online training or for video sessions please visit us at www.testingtoolsonline.in or else you can call us at the below given number. Thank you so much.